Hello everybody and welcome back to another game of Pomper. We are playing some red green aggro. And we are going second. Uh this is a good hand. It's got a turn one neonate to two turn three worm, I guess. We can keep this. Oh, Halimar Depths. Okay. Probably Demir, I guess. Hmm. We'll have to see. Not many decks play this, so... Could be a homebrew of some kind. Alright. Got another mountain. That's alright, I guess, but... And if they try to kill the neonate, we can always just basking Rootwalla for free. Ooh. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll opt for the Rugged Highlands instead. No need to run out the Rootwalla. Let's get him for one. Pass the turn. And again, we can always Rootwalla. Uh, if ever they try to kill the Neonate, so... Okay, it's just going to be another Deaths. Sure. This time they have two mana. Left. I guess I will... Attack for one. And uh, I guess they're going to try to do something on our end step, probably. No? Okay. I guess I'll pass then. Jeez, a lot of lands, unfortunately. I was kind of afraid of Condescend, but... Okay, then. I guess we'll pass. Now I'm definitely screwed. <laughs> what have I done? All right, let's keep getting in. Let's see if they uh, bite on a root walla. Nope. Okay. Come on, tap out. Nope. All right. Well, this root wall is going to start hitting you pretty hard. Another chancery. Okay. You're going to have to discard a hand size. Are you sure about that? Planes. Okay. Guess I'll play the Highlands. Ah. Maybe that was a mistake. Yeah. Let's start hitting them. And I guess we'll we'll wait on the root wallet again. Since I can't worm. Really would like to see what our opponent's up to. Ah, I guess the cards are out. Now I'm sad I missed out on uh, this opportunity. I should have played an untapped land. My bad. For reference, this card just came out today. <laughs> really, really good card. Probably one of the better cards to come out of... Um, of Ravnica Allegiance for Popper. Really, really nice stuff. Okay. Let's go for a mountain. Yeah. 
I guess we'll play a second Root Walla. He bites. One, two, three, four, five. Ugh. Really want to see how our opponent wins. Maybe I was just way too conservative conservative with these worms. We'll have to see. Ah, oh, man, more lands. Alright, well, let's keep getting in. Opponent's not going to touch this neonate with a 9-foot pole, it seems. Go up to 23, I guess. Just wanted to tap out. Hmm. Is two, four, five, six, seven mana? I guess I'll. I guess I'll bite the bullet and I'll try. At worst, I still get to cantrip and get another card, and I can still Lightning Axe, I guess. Well, I need a target for Lightning Axe, I guess. So I can hard cast the Reckless Worm, but... So, he can also cast this on his main phase to deal 5 damage to something. This kills Anglers for 2 mana. Kills pretty much everything for 2 mana. Everything except an Ulamog's Crusher, I guess. Okay, there's the cover-up. Okay. I Am I getting milled? Is that what's happening? 1, 2, 3... Okay, all right, up to the mountain. We'll hard cast the Reckless Worm. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get there. I'm gonna flicker some stuff. Oh man, it's one of these. I think Ghostly Flicker is probably the card that I hate the most in Popper. Absolutely. This card just does some dumb stuff. Ugh. Alright. Opponent's down to two cards. Man, we are just drawing so many lands. I mean, good news is our opponent's down to two cards. Oh, it's going to be card draw. Oh, good grief. <laughs> It's one of these. Well, luckily we're staying ahead on time. It might actually come down to that. So we know one of the cards is... Um, and we're going to discard uh, Mountain. We know one of the one of their cards is um, Capsize, so we this is a pretty free thing to draw. We got a Neonate, that's nice. All this dead burn. Guess we'll play the Rugged Highlands again, up to 25. And I will, you know, if they try to kill the Neonate, I will just Lightning Axe it. 
I mean, I will discard a card to draw. Discard the Lightning Axe to draw with the Neonate. All right, another capsize. Yep, you got it. Well, I guess all this, all these land drops are going to pay off in the end. It's going to take longer for him to lock us out. But this might just be a game where uh, we are three minutes ahead and it's going to matter. He's going to have to deal with the Neonate eventually, too. Take your time. Got almost three minutes on him. Okay, he's gonna bounce the Neonate. Yeah, you know what? That's fine. I'll just recast it next turn. Eventually, I'll draw more than one threat. Oh, you know what? That was a bad idea. I should have just sacrificed it, and that would have countered the uh, capsize. Back the ghostly flicker, eh? Three, four, five. All right, and so it begins. Even if I are if I lightning bolt the archaeomancer at this point, it's not going to do very much. Okay, so now we play our neonate. Whoa! Two, three, ugh. Okay, fine. I guess I could have held up... Ugh. I keep thinking of things I could have done afterwards. I should have Lightning Bolt and then Fiery Tempered in response to the Ghostly Flicker. That would have made a lot more sense. Go for Mongrel. That's a really good draw. It's going to capsize here. So, you know, I could Lightning Axe. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Six, seven, eight. Yeah, okay. So I think I can get rid of Capsize and Archaeomancer. Um, so let's start with Lightning Bolt. Yeah, I have exactly enough. Opponent's going to try to Ghostly Flicker. Uh, okay. And then flicker. Okay. So now we fiery temper. Oh, now we use, wait, now we use mongrel. Discarding Fiery Temper. Killing the Archaeomancer. Why are you playing Quench? <laughs> oh no. You get your Halamar Depths back. Uh, but now... And now I have to discard my other Lightning Axe, which is okay. You lose your Capsize. Whew. Okay, preordained, sure.
bolus. Sure. Oh, <laughs> I worked so hard to get rid of this. Uh, we're going to make his life miserable. Yeah, I'm just going to make the game as long as possible. We're up a solid four minutes now. my highlands and pass oh you know I can play lands all day that's fine Ugh, why are we playing quench I really want another uh, Neonate right now. That's a good card. Let's see if that works. Cool. Let's go Mongrel. Man, how many lands have we gone through? One... Two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen lands. Jeez, seven left in our deck. Almost got condescend this time. Or are they just gonna capsize again? Yeah, we got over five minutes now. <laughs> you gain X life. Sure. Can I pay nine? One, two, three, four, five, six. No, I cannot. Well, it's back up to 21. Ooh, there's the RKO Mancer. Okay. It's back Ghostly Flicker now. Now it's going to be much harder for us to win. But, again, time is definitely on our side here. So we know half their hand. You just gotta make him play. I really don't mind. Yep. Pounce the capsize. Sure. You're going to time out before you kill me in 26 turns. I'm a patient, patient person. You got a counter th counters this time? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I'll pay six. Right. 
more choices. Sure, I like that. That's fine. These decks just aren't practical in a TGO. I don't even think they're practical in real life, honestly. When you only have 50 minutes to play, you just end up drawing everything. I ran into that problem um, just playing Turbo Fog, and I actually have a win condition. Okay. Well, there's Mongrel. Let's get in for four. Draw two. Okay, well, let's try. Whoa. Probably won't resolve, but we'll have to see. I'll make him use him. Alright, straight up counterspell. You got it. I've still got two creatures on board, though. I wonder why he uh, flickered just to get the Halimar Death's trigger? I don't know if that's super productive. Okay, five damage. You know what? Nothing, no wild mongrel activation is going to matter here, so it's going to go ahead and F6. Yeah, we're going to have eight minutes on our opponent. There's no way they're making it through game two, even if they win. And they are far from winning right now. Flicker. And a devious cover up here. Yep, that's look like looks like what it is. Take your time. Yep. So our opponent's got to make so many choices with the Halimar depths and the Devious cover-ups and stuff. All this takes time. It took him forever just to cast the Devious cover-up. Turn 22. Oh, now he's going to start winning. <laughs> Draw three. Maybe he drew another counter spell or not. So he's going to capsize then counter. There you go. Gonna 
go see Flickr again? All right, then you go for it. That was pretty risky. Yeah, what I wouldn't give for a neonate right now would be so good. Draw four. Okay. Guild gate. Like at this point, I've won. There's there's no way our opponent wins the match. It's I don't think it's possible. They've got under eight minutes left. They haven't been able to deal damage to me. They've dealt one damage to me, maybe. And over the course of this game? Alright. Journey. Sure. Ooh, double Archaeo Mancer. Now we're getting somewhere. That lets our opponent uh, get back pretty much everything they want from their graveyard for only three mana. Getting back Counterspell. Yep, that's great. Opponent was smart and didn't use... Uh, didn't use their uh, ghostly flicker. All right, we're dead in 12 turns. Reckless Worm, sure. Can't really stop that, so I guess we'll have to be patient. We come across a couple really dirtly decks these days. I think that's where Matt, uh, Popper's heading right now, though. I mean, <laughs> my Turbo Fog deck is going to change a lot with uh, a new card coming out in Ravnica Allegiance. Clear the mind. Oh my goodness. We are. Uh, we're going to dirtle. <laughs> oh man. I don't even think I'm going to record those games anymore because it's going to be just horrible to watch. Kind of like this. Yep. I wanted to go twice. Okay. <laughs> All these double takes the opponent's doing is just not helping their cause either. They've got to, they've got to win. They just got to win. That's all. But there's no way they're surviving game two with five minutes. That's just not happening. All right, double lightning bolt. Opponents realizing they're short on time. I'm gonna stop casting spells. So hopefully we draw a creature here. Boo. Okay.
All right, there goes one. There goes the other. Now we have six. Double counter spell. Yep, sure. And this is not something that you'll see in a tournament either, unfortunately. It's just too too dirty. This is a, a tournament practice deck. For whatever that's worth. And important to note, the opponent uh, can prevent themselves from milling out uh, through the use of uh, devious cover-up on their own spells. Even if I don't cast a single spell in this entire game, they can just chain devious cover-ups until, uh, until I mill out. Hey, they're speeding up the clock. All right, Faithless Looting, let's do it. One more. Let's resolve the worm first. Getting stuff to do. Another exclude. Okay. And we'll target our Kaomancer. And then we lightning axe it. One gone. <laughs> it took all of our resources to do that, but you know. Again, it's making him play. Oh. Yeah, I'll pay for quench. We'll pretend that was a mana leak and that I paid for it. Oh, I can't pay for that. Okay. Wait, what was that Fiery Temper even targeting? Wasn't it targeting the uh, Archaeomancer that was dead? Why did I fight for that? Although I guess it was zero cost for me. All it did was gain them three life. That was weird. Okay, now our opponent might win, but they've lost the match. And somehow, they're only four cards deeper than we are. Even through all the excludes and stuff. Although I guess the devious cover-ups, yeah, they've technically drawn at least like four or more cards more than we have. Under two minutes left for the opponent? Sure. Hey, there's a root walla. Okay. Let's do it on their upkeep. So let's uh, kill the Archaeomancer, discarding the root walla. We'll cast that for free. So whose deck is better? Hmm? Is my deck worse because I can't <laughs> win? Or is his deck worse because he can't win?
actually. Not going to yield to that just in case we've got uh, Basking Root Walla. I doubt it'll resolve. If, if it doesn't resolve, we're just going to F6, but. All right. You're pretty dead, dude. <laughs> Is he even going to win match one? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. <laughs> if you stuck around for it, well, you guys are crazy. And uh, thank you. So <laughs> we'll see you guys next time, okay? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Goodbye. Hey. What? There we go. Okay.